Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and today I no also today I'm going to be reviewing the official teaser of the new movie coming out it's going to be called Black Panther Wakanda Forever which Black Panther 2 and you know it's a good day or good tomorrow depending how you look at it um you know the copyright situations it went okay and so now you're getting the review awesome so that means I'm reviewing the movie we said same thing with Doctor Strange 2 and Thor Love and Thunder um, if the copyright goes well with reacting to the trailer and reviewing the trailer then I'll review the movie so if you're still wondering I am gonna review those two movies I just don't know when this is gonna happen so but anyway, um, okay, so, um, let's get started. So we, um, forgive me, because I haven't really, maybe I should say it, um, I haven't fully seen the first Black Panther movie, but of what I heard, it's okay. Like it's an okay movie, and but I, I'm just gonna go by as I know them, and I'm pretty sure this was T'Challa's girlfriend, maybe. Yeah, I think this was his love interest. Yeah, I I, I think it was. I, I could be totally wrong, but I, I think this is who she was. Um. <clears throat> <clears throat> so she's wearing this like green outfit well that looks pretty cool she's on she's on the beach and we see this aztec type of um um like your aztec staircase and so i'm i'm assuming is she just out here thinking is she looking for namor oh, who knows um and we hear a song called, um, what was it called? Something, the No no Woman Cry, I think it's from Bob Marley, I, I believe. I'm, I'm sorry if I said the name wrong. But we have um, the queen, um, T'Challa's mother, and um, I forgot her name. Um, but the, um, the second command from T'Challa, the, like, the number one guard, I should say. Like, you know, they're walking somewhere. And we see, like, the throne room. I guess they're, like, having a discussion about something. Maybe it's, maybe it's about T'Challa or something. I, I don't know. Um, I, I like the throne. It looks pretty cool. Um, let's see. A lot of people are saying that this is the funeral and it looks more like a celebration well, so this is interesting so and um, a lot of the the lyrics is about um we look forward to the future but we don't forget about our past and stuff like that so you know that's important we have to remember the past and a lot of people I didn't mention this in my reaction because I was you know I'll, I'll save whatever was in the reaction it's for the reaction but I'm just talking about what is here now and people are saying that um, because of the white hair right here and some people over here, people are saying that um, the people of, um, I don't want to say like of related to, because that seems kind of weird, but of related to Sue Storm, um, like this is going to be her people. People are saying that she might, she's most likely not going to make an appearance here. But this is her people, like, like this is her family and stuff like that. So that's pretty interesting. Because I think Sue Storm was in a couple Black Panther comics, I believe. So that would be pretty cool if this is her people and they mentioned, oh, Sue or Miss Storm is off doing something. So, oh, that's pretty cool. But, you know, speculation. So they're doing some sort of dance um, to, like, celebrate. And obviously, I'm pretty sure this is Suri and she's obviously sad because her brother said and um if you are unaware um i hopefully i don't say his name wrong 
Chad, Chad, Chadwick, 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 sorry, Chadwick Bozeman, I believe that's his name, I'm sorry if I said it wrong, um, he, you know, passed away, so they, um, allowed the name T'Challa, the character, to pass on also, so we don't know what's going to happen if Namor kills him, or if it's in battle, or if it's a sickness, we really don't know, we just see what's supposedly the funeral here, so, yeah, so, you know, um, you, you um, words, um, rest in peace, Chadwick Boseman, I think he did a really good, great job as Black Panther, you know, um, hopefully, um, oh, what comes into the future will be, for the most part, good. You know, and, and that's, that's all we can expect, right? Um, and, ooh, um, anyway. So, it's more of the funeral. Uh, I'm suspecting the funeral. Um, and then we had this really cool shot with the, I'm assuming the sunrise? It's like in the early morning. And we have the second command, and I forgot their group, but like the, the lady, um, warriors of Wakanda, and like you know they're like you know, has their like their staves, like you know, and they're, they're banging it, and then we had this cool image of the beach and with the water. Ooh, that's pretty cool. I like water. And we obviously have like the, the mom, the, the queen, just looking on the distance. I wonder, is she just just like with um T'Challa's I'm I'm assuming ex girlfriend, I don't know. Um not her, she's sorry, I'm talking about the beginning of the trailer. Um, are they both looking for Namor or are they just thinking? Or both? And Namor just happens to be there. Who knows? We have we have Shuri and she's crying because yeah, her brother said. And, um, this is Namor's mother, I believe, giving birth. So, and this must be the quote-unquote, like, nurse, or maybe this could be the father, but we know. If they're going by the comics, Namor is, by the comics, he's half Atlantean, but now half Aztec, you know, version of that. So this can't be the dad, unless they're changing it and making him, but why isn't he blue then? Anyway, um, so this must be like the nurse or the doctor to help her give birth. Uh, that's what I was originally going to say before I was thinking, maybe this could be the father, but I'm like, no, how is he breathing underwater? Or unless he, we can't see, he's wearing like a mask or something, but I don't, I don't think, she, I don't think he is. And then we see baby Namor and we see the wings on the feet. So from, from like in the comics. So. It looks comic accurate. Um, people said he has pointy ears and they're not doing the pointy ears. So that, that's kind of weird. Um, we see this big light. There's speculation all over the place of what this could be. So I, I, I'm just going to leave up, up for grabs of what you think because this really could be anything. And he's wearing his um, traditional... I'm still Aztec outfit. Maybe it's like a ceremony or something. He's, you know, he turns around and stares something. We see this whale. Or two whales. I'm assuming Atlanteans. Um, are, sorry. The Aztec version of Atlanteans are hanging onto it. So, oh, that, that could be interesting. They're rising to the surface. And, um, did we see this, like, army people? gonna scuba dive into the water i'm assuming where namor is but why I, again go back to my reaction i kind of you know there's people where we're thinking i kind of want to talk about in my review in case in case it does happen so just i, I wonder if atuma is gonna show up what if this is just a setup from atuma maybe because I don't want to just be bland. It's just, oh, just the government is just mining in the water. I don't know. That, that'd be kind of boring. So, I don't know. Maybe it's the Tuma. Then, we see these, this army person kind of forcing this person to activate something. Like a wall or maybe to read it. I don't know. And, like, just surrounding people. 
Then we see the Wakanda throne room covered in flames, and we see water. So I'm assuming the waters are covered in oil or something. And this is sure yet. I, I, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. And then we see Riri Williams. Um, and yeah, I guess they're like, they're like best buds or something. People say there's like an outreach program that was in the first Black Panther movie. Um, it was either Black Panther or um, Civil War. Where um, they, they said there's going to be an outreach program for people that's outside of Wakanda, of Wakanda can come in and learn, basically. Um, so for like gifted students. So it would make sense why Riri was there because why wasn't she in the first film and stuff like that? Or why wasn't she mentioned? Riri Williams, Ironheart. Like, who knows? Hopefully they fixed her character because I really don't want to talk about it. Because when I first heard about Ironheart, Riri Williams' character in the comics, because then I recently heard about it again because I was like, thank goodness I forgot about it. I was like, oh, Ironheart. Then I heard about it again, like a full detail. And I'm like, Oh my gosh. So hopefully they don't go that route. But the first time, I do not want the comic version of a character because it's just too bad. I, I, I don't know. I don't, want to, I, don't, I don't want to talk about it. If you want to look for yourself, I'm pretty sure there are Ironheart comics available. So, you know, go check it out, I guess. Then, we, okay, we see this house with a wagon. And... That's interesting. Is this like a mansion or something? And it's covered in flames. And we see the Lanterns and Baby Namor. Is this part of the reason why there's a feud with with the Wakanda? Was was this Namor's house? Because he's half human. So um, I don't know. Then we have like I'm assuming adult Namor like rising up from the water and Atlanteans are already there and I'm assuming Wakanda oh wait wait hold on is that pointy ears oh he does have the pointy ears oh the one people talking about maybe maybe because it was um, a lot of people said that it was kind of moving too quickly uh, not not for me the the images were moving too quickly so maybe they didn't get to see the pointy ears maybe they didn't think it was pointy enough but you can kind of see it right there so, I don't know. At least it got the wings. Um, then we see this big, like, um, what is this? We, we see, like, a helicopter going to somewhere. It's a pretty cool statue right here, but what is this? Like a staircase? Yeah, I think this is, like, a staircase right here. That's pretty cool. In the snowy mountains. Then we have this guy um, from the first Black Panther movie. I, I forgot his name. And we have the queen talking over where she's saying that I'm the queen of, of of Wakanda, the richest place in the world. And uh, I have lost my entire family. And we saw that guy. We saw the second command lady with the, I forgot the group name. This is, the, um, again, the ex-girlfriend, I believe. Then we have the queen going to like a room. Then everyone's doing... They're reaching out their hand. Is this the salute, um, Black Panther to, to um, T'Challa? It might be. I really don't know. Is this in? Is this the United Nations? I don't, I really don't know. They're, they're somewhere. Then we have this beautiful portrait of T'Challa. Uh, words T'Challa, and they're at the funeral. I'm supposing because of the white outfits. Close up. And you, we have, you know, the, the queen saying, like, ha my whole family is dead. I'm like, what about Shuri? And we saw Shuri in the throne room with, with the fire. So does Shuri die? I, I, I don't know. Then we have the Atlanteans. It makes sense why they're wearing masks because they can't breathe in air. Well, non Atlanteans. So you, know, you know what I mean. Then we have Riri Williams. And her haircut is comic book accurate. And she's making her sue, and we have the heart, and falls to the ground. So, Iron Heart. Then we have, the Atlanteans are just, like, dodging the bullets, and Namor is just taking it. So, um, I wonder how powerful he's going to be. Then, obviously, we have him turn around, and we had the, you know, the guy from the first movie. It's about to attack Namor. And, um, it looks like we have a, 
I don't know, someone here in the um the, the group that I was mentioning earlier gonna attack someone. I don't know. Then we have Namor here, I believe. Like you know, rubbing his hand against some Aztec art. Then we have this. Is this Namor's mom? Might be. Then we see the Wakanda being flooded, and that's in the comics, so do they move Wakanda to somewhere else, maybe? Who knows? We have the second command lady about to fight. We, we have a car in a motorcycle. We see a bunch of police cars. Well, what's going on? Bunch of fire. I, I'm assuming this is Shuri again, and she's crying. Someone's holding her. Uh, I wonder what's going on. Again, the army guys. So what's going on there? We have Namor. Is he rising? Or no, he's descending into the throne that looks like a shark mouth, so that's pretty cool. And we have the again the army group gonna fight the um the Aztec version of the Atlanteans. And then we have the new Black Panther, um and then like the the class come out. Um can I get the class scene? Oh, okay, there, there we go. There's the class right there. It goes pretty quick. And it's like a gold and black outfit. So, um, people saying it might be Shuri. People saying it might be the ex-girlfriend, maybe. Who knows? And then, you know, um, Black Panther Wakanda Forever. And then comes out November. Okay, um... Pretty cool teaser. Um, you're starting to get a little bit tired right now, so I kind of wanted to make this a quick video. I'm not sure how long I've been talking, but yeah, we saw a couple things. We saw Namor. Um, we probably saw like how powerful he is. Does he flood Wakanda? Um, um, Namor's mom, is she important? Um, that little Namor was, was at his house that got burned. Um, Shuri, is she the new Black Panther? Is it the ex-girlfriend? Is it that, that, that guy? Um, who knows? The mom, which she says my whole family said, either that's just gonna be cut from the movie and either someone else is gonna say it or, um, or Shuri actually kicks the bucket and she actually dies. I don't know. Um... She, she might, but that'd be kind of weird to if she is going to be Black Panther to introduce the new Black Panther and then just die in the movie. That, that'd be kind of... Unless it's supposed to symbolize that um, no matter how early or late the mantle comes with Black Panther, you will always be Black Panther forever or, or something like that. Is that supposed to, be, supposed to be the message that you are always Black Panther? And... Whoever is next will take on the legacy of from you and the one that's before. So maybe I don't know. It's, that's that's kind of weird that she says my whole family's dead. But who knows? Um. So um yeah. Um. Does Namor flood Wakanda? That's my big question. Um. Um. My my first question that I put in the th the reaction is saying like. Who do, you, who do you think is going to be the next Black Panther? That's still a question, but now the question for this, my, my review is, is Namor going to flood Wakanda? Because, like, are they going to leave? Are they going to rebuild? How long is it going to take to rebuild? Like, are some people, like, in the outreach program, are, are they going to have to leave? Because Ironheart, Reed Williams, are, is usually associated in, like, New York and with tall buildings. That, no, no, Wakanda tall buildings, but... Like mo multiple, multiple tall buildings. So, does Wakanda get flooded and Riri has to take her suit and go back to New York or something? I, I don't know. I don't know. Um. So um. Yeah. Everyone, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell. Give me a big thumbs up. Leave a, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to share the video. And I'll see you guys. Um tomorrow for the ghost and molly mcgee season one episode 15 and that's the one that's been long overdue that i need to do because 
uh, I don't think it, maybe it wasn't a good idea because I wanted to end on an even number, but of where, um, it, I don't know. It was kind of weird. I, like, but my thinking at the time, I thought it would seem like a good idea, but now I'm thinking maybe I should have just done the episode. I don't know. But I'm going to do it Monday, and then finally throughout the week, like of technically next week, because today is still Sunday, kind of. Um, so for the rest of that week, it's going to be non-stop to go to Mama McGee until Sunday, which will be Shazam to Fury of the Gods, the, the reaction and review to that trailer. So, um, yeah, I'll see you guys that I'll see you guys then for that. Okay. Bye.